it's Megan. Welcome back here to Walshman Homestead and welcome back to the kitchen. But today's video is not a kitchen video, uh, not a recipe video, I should say. Uh, today's video is a little bit different. Um, it is not a sponsored video, it is just my own personal opinion on a specific product. Um, so this would be my favorite accessory. I'm not a woman of jewelry and things, but I do love this accessory. It is my favorite. If you are not sure what this accessory is, it is a gun belt. So when I first started carrying, um, I always carried my nine. It was the first um, thing that Dylan ever got me, um, and I just really love it. Um, and so I wanted to be able to carry it, uh, having the kids and things. At first it was in the diaper bag, and you know, digging through the diaper bag isn't the way to go. So Dylan got me this holster. It is from Alien Gear. Alien Gear has some really neat different holsters, things like that. And you can order specific to whatever you decide to carry. Um, so this is specifically designed for my Taurus 9mm. Um, and then it also came with like a bit, a, um, loop for your belt where it's totally enclosed or it has a clip and just that's just real bulky on my side and I just didn't care for it so that's where I ended up getting the uh, hip hooker and I just absolutely love it so a little about my favorite accessory here uh, this is a can can hip hugger it uh, has the ability to hold four pistols and two mags um, but you know always make sure you're following state guidelines federal guidelines all those things um, when you carry if you need a permit all of those things make sure you know um, what is legal wherever you are so this holster is able to carry four so you can put two in the front and you can slide two in the back and then on either side uh, on your hips there is a great big pocket um, that you can fit in, fit a magazine in. I tend to, like, I'll even put my phone in it or my wallet fits in here. Um, you know, and if you wanted to carry a knife, things like that, you could carry um, real simple right here. Like, I have a food allergy, so sometimes I'll just drop my EpiPens down in it. Now the EpiPens stick up a little high, but, you know, I'm hands free with them. Uh, but on the back side, there is like a lacing, and this is a pocket. Now, I would not recommend putting anything in this pocket simply because if you were ever in an altercation or anything like that um, and you got slammed up against a surface, whether it be a wall, a door, the floor, a table, anything like that, whatever is in this pocket is going to slam your back. And so, you know, there just honestly shouldn't be anything in this pocket for your safety and for your protection. Um, now, the thing that I like about this is. I have two choices. I have my Taurus 9mm, it's a G2, um, that I can carry in here and it fits totally fine. Um, it does stick out a little bit at the top, but that gives me the ability to grab it easier. Um, and then I also have a Taurus 380. So that one is smaller, sleeker, slender, um, and it just slides kind of down in there. So if I'm going somewhere, you know, that I want it to be more hidden. Um, I will pick the 380 if I want, you know, if I'm out and about, whatever, shopping, you know, you might pick your 9. Um, so it's kind of personal preference. I know there are other ladies that carry other things, things like that. Um, but in picking your belt, you want to keep in mind your gun size uh, because they do come wider um, depending on how big your barrel is. Uh, so I've had this one probably almost a year and I love it. Um, on the inside, it has kind of like a rubber elastic that runs on the bottom and the top. And so like it kind of helps it from sliding and slipping. Uh, for the most part, it just stays put. If I have on like a looser pair of jeans and like I'm pulling up the jeans, the belt will rise a little bit, but nothing like uncomfortable. Um, but with this belt, I can wear practically anything. Um, so I'm gonna slip this on and kind of show you what it looks like on um, I'll try some different outfits on things like that that way you can kind of see how it fits with different things and how it conceals can you tell I'm carrying um, I will start off by saying both of these uh, things that I'm going to show you are completely unloaded um, for safety and for the purpose of this video um, but so I have my 380 right here uh, you can kind of tell in the t-shirt that there's a kind of a box um, but other than that you kind of don't really notice it um, if I stand up straight, you can kind of see it, um, but very easily 
you're able to pull it out and use it as need be. If it's on your hip, it to me it hides more on the 380 hides more on my hip, but real easily you're able to grab and go. Now for my uh, nine, it sticks out a little more, so you see it a little bit more, but. Um, you know, you can still pull and use as you need, and then it sticks out a little bit more. But it's right there when you need it to pull and go and do whatever it is you're needing to do. Um, so this is kind of what it is with a t-shirt. I'll slide into something different and show you how it conceals in a little bit of a different outfit or a different look. So this is a little bit different. Um, my 380 is on the front and my 9 is on the back. So you can kind of see how they show and stick. You can kind of see how they sit. Um, again, I'm like a toothpick, so I don't have curves and things that might help me uh, disguise something. Like the other outfit I had on jeans, this outfit is uh, like yoga pants. And so it's right here or right here. Um, and I don't need a belt. Um, and that's what I really love about this is I can wear comfortable things like this and still be comfortable and still be able to carry um, and you know have whichever size I choose on and I don't have to have the big bulkiness of a belt or a big old piece on the side. Um, I'm going to jump into one more other little outfit and then that kind of kind of shows you how it does with other things um, and uh, the versatility of this product. I will say that this product is US made um, so that's always another really great bonus. So this outfit's kind of not total perfect, um, but it is just a tank top and a pair of like jogging pants. Um, but as you can see, I am carrying still. Um, and I mean, that's what I really like about this is that, you know, I have on yoga pants and I don't need the belt. Um, and it hugs and it sits right where I need it to be. It's close. It's close to the body. It's not... You know attached and kind of flopping around with your belt um, so that's just kind of why I really love this product you know and having it a year I've gotten com more comfortable with it um, and you know I have a specific way that I like it to be worn um, but, you know you kind of get that way with different products and things that you wear so I will leave a link down in the description below um, to the can can website again it's not sponsored so I don't get anything um, from doing this video. It's just my own personal opinion and kind of the way the world is going. Maybe uh, you want to have um, a little friend by your side. Um, in saying that though, I would definitely recommend um, getting training with whatever you, whatever you choose to do, um, whatever you choose to carry. Um, you know, depending on where you live, different trainings, whether it's through a police station or through like um, a gun association or a gun course things like that. Know your weapon inside and out. Know how to break it down and put it back together without any help. Um, you know, know how to clean it. Know what kind of rounds you want to carry. All of those things. Just make sure that um, you're 100% confident in yourself and 100% confident in whatever you are choosing to carry. Um, and also, you know, know your gun laws. Know your um, the laws in your area if you're traveling. Know the laws wherever you are traveling to. Um, that way you protect your, protect yourself um, and uh, just be aware of all of those things if you do choose to carry. Um, that's kind of all that I have for today's video. Thanks for watching. As always, take care and God bless.